I just wanna rolly, rolly, rolly with a dab of ranch. I already got some designer to hold on my pants. I just want some ice. Everything black, everything black, everything black, everything black. Hey, what's going on, guys? Today I'll be starting a new series where I basically look at some designs I have recently made or some I have made before that have turned out pretty well and tell you like how I got the idea for them and stuff like that. So first of all, I started this desire one or desire. I don't really know how to say his name. I just know it's D X and then sire, something like that. So first of all, let's just remove all of these little things right here. And you can basically see it's just a bunch of his headers back there. So my original idea was for something blue. And then I started looking at his port and stuff like that. And well, I got the idea of implementing that stuff into it. So then, I, like, that's what I basically did. And I added this little logo, like, logo, which wasn't very hard to make at all. Um, I literally just, no, it wasn't that one. It was this one. And I took this logo and that and basically put it on there. And, yeah, it was basically all that. And I just used a little effect on his thing. Just added a couple effects there. And, yeah, it basically made us happy. And just put it on there and got these effects. They look really nice in my opinion. And that's why I used them. And, and I don't know if you can see this or not. Where is it? This little thing right here. Those are the little like lines effects and stuff like that. So if you equipped like all of these then you could really see it. I see back there. But I mean it, it just kind of adds some like personality into it in my opinion. And now we will be moving on to this monkey one, or monkey. I haven't talked to this guy in a long time, but I made this one a long time ago and I still had the PSD, so I was like, why not show this one off? Because I think I did pretty good on this one. So this one was when I was still learning how to use text and stuff, but I essentially took this picture and did a bunch of stuff to it. So we'll just remove all of this stuff. And this is what the original picture looked like. So then I just added some lightning bolts back here. And then I added this pink, uh, like pink little gradient map. So that honestly really made this look nice because um, Monkey told me about the gradient maps. So I tried them out and well, it turned out pretty good. And then I just started adding his YouTube logos and stuff and just added the faces. I'm not sure why that box is there really. But I mean, I just tried going for a purple theme here because his um, like my mascot or whatever is purple so that's why i did that this one i'm not going to talk about because it was pretty simple to do and this one it honestly took a lot of time to make this big effect this is still like a work in progress of when recording this which i don't even know what the tit the date is today but by the time this goes up it'll be way done but essentially i wanted to do like a theme where it's like these lines and stuff but then I at first tried it with, where is the background here? Let me remove all this. So I first had done it with this area and uh, had a blue logo. So that's kind of what it looked like originally, which didn't look very good in my opinion. So then I kind of switched it up to this, which that was before I had all that. So then I found these things, which I can't remember. I think it was under filters or styles on here. And I added those to it. So then I added it to up here as well. And it made it look like have a little nice texture to it. And um, it kind of looks more like World War II themed. And then I also added a CC to it from this pack. So it's pretty nice. It made it look from uh, this to that. So this is the final copy of the Abbey. It looks pretty nice in my opinion. I mean, once again, it's pretty easy. I just took this like old picture looking thing, put a black layer on it. So it made it a bit darker. Then added that image down there, and yeah, the image I basically just took from right here. I literally just stretched that out and put it right there. Simple enough. And yeah, that's essentially how I made this. It took actually a long time brainstorming all the ideas for that. Because I didn't have an idea at all for it. Like this one, I literally just found this really cool like blue picture thing. And I basically rolled with it. So that's how I made these three pretty amazing headers in my opinion and hopefully you guys enjoyed this and if you want this to be like a 
full series where I review why I picked each thing for the, um, like, um, revamps and, like, what specific details I really needed in them, then, uh, tell me down below. I may start doing this series again. And, yeah, I'll see you guys later. Peace out. Metro on that beat.